สวัสดีค่ะ What up, peeps? Welcome to my vlog 32. Today I want to talk about things to do in Thailand and definitely things you better don't do in Thailand. All right. So here we go. Number one, this you never ever do in Thailand. This is your brain. <laughs> this is your brain on falling in love with a working girl in Thailand. Any questions? That's it. End of my vlog. Everything is uh, spoken out. All right? No, I'm just kidding. Here's number two. So, whenever you're entering somebody's house, somebody invites you to his house or whatsoever, you please take off the shoes. If you walk in with the shoes, that means again, you don't show any respect, okay? Every Thai people take off their shoes. This is simple, the rule, and if you do it, you're always welcome in my house and anybody else's house. Many times here in Thailand, I thought I'm going to sponsor to the government a huge billboard with an inscription who says, this is how an asshole looks like and I my idea is to just photograph people who drive from back from the beach to their hotel or to their apartments without wearing any t-shirt they're just wearing their uh, trousers or small shorts or even bath boots you know and most likely hachis you know what I mean? Hachis. Most likely, okay? And this is something I really, really hate from all my heart. I mean, those people, they don't show any respect here in Thailand. They would not drive without any uh, t-shirt or any whatsoever, you know, like on their streets in their country. Why those guys have to do it here? This is... Hey, no respect, you get no respect from me, okay? So... This is what you definitely should not do in Thailand as well. Number three. Number four. Never touch Thai people on their head. This is the highest part of their body and this is holy for them. If you do that, like, you know, like, hey, brother, how you doing? You know, hey, oh, nice kid. Don't do it. It's really disrespectful. Don't do it. If you don't believe me, Google it. I don't want to make a vlog like 10,000 million minutes long, you know. So just Google it, it's very easy. So easy, just don't touch the head and you will have their respect, okay? Another rule which you should really respect is, and actually it's common sense, is don't compare your country too much with Thailand. You know, I've seen a lot of people, they come to Thailand and they compare their country to the Thai country. Like, uh, you know, in my country, everything is better. We have the better cars, we have the better motorbikes, we have the better police, there is no corruption in my country, there is not this, there is not that, there is not that. You know what they think? Why don't you go back? What do you do here? You know, it's different. They, they love the country. So, I, we love the country. So, just simply don't compare your country to the Thai country and just enjoy your life a little more and stop complaining, okay? A little less complain and enjoy a little bit more your life and everything is fine. Next rule, very important rule in Thailand, very, very important rule, respect the king and respect the king's family. This is not just about respect, it is the law in Thailand. You know, everybody, in every shop, every household, even mine, we got a picture from the king. To disrespect the king or the king's family is the worst you can do in this country. If you go public and say, fuck your king, fuck your king, and I'm really sorry I just mentioned it, please don't do that. There is no meaning to say that. There is no need to say that. This is a great king. Everybody loves him. Me as a foreigner, I really love the king in Thailand. So never insult the king or the king's family. And remember, this is not only about respect, it is the law. Next rule. Very simple rule as well, very easy. Never show your feet toward the face to somebody else. Never point your feet to somebody. 
this is very very bad the feet are the lowest part of your body and they are filthy so you don't do that you don't even yourself you don't want somebody to look hey you can you bring me a beer this is so disrespectful so you simply don't do this okay in Thailand you don't shake hands in Thailand you why people you as a foreigner you why the people you don't go to somebody and say hey nice to meet you my name is Sunny my name is George my name is Lucas you don't do that you just say simply as a man you say Sawadi crap you don't have to why them here this is Buddha this is the king all right this is absolutely enough to anybody else also you do never ever why somebody who is on a lower status like yourself so you never do why a kid or a, uh, a small minor uh, kid or somebody who is much much younger than you much younger I'm 48 I don't why somebody who's 20 and it got nothing to do I'm not polite or I'm like a snob it got nothing to do this is their culture you know I just follow the simple basic rules in Thailand all right so many times I made this mistake as well so my wife she always almost hit me say you many times I told you you don't have to give them a white back you know it, it is simply like that when I when uh, when I see people coming in with the little kids and the mama says to them, oh, look, um, look here, Lung Sunny, Uncle Sunny, huh? give him a wine, they give me a wine. I, at the beginning, I was so stupid and I just wanted to be polite back because I didn't know the rules. So I just gave him a wine back and my wife almost kicked me in my ass. I said, you don't do that. And I did this mistake many times. So I learned it right now. Now, sometimes I feel uncomfortable because I just want to be polite. But I learned one thing now after 15 years in Thailand, you simply don't why somebody on lower status than yourself, all right? That was today my little advice to you guys. I made a very short vlog right now. I know it's not that much, but I hope it will help you for your next Thailand visit. And I hope you will consider what I said right now. And, oh, there's one more. And again, one more rule for you men when you come to Thailand, okay? Check this out again. This is your brain. This is your brain on falling in love with a working girl in Thailand. So simply don't do that and you will be absolutely fine in this country. Right now I'm going to edit this video and I'm working on a new intro. I need to make a new intro. The new YouTube rules are very heavy right now. I need to explain myself what is my YouTube channel all about. So that's why, please forgive me if I don't do a vlog for the next two or three days. I try to do any way to do a vlog. I try to do and film everything I can for you guys to keep you posted what's going on in my life. Um, I, like I said, I need to, to, uh, to edit my videos right now and then I have to dress up uh, first have to take a shower because I'm sweating again I'm a sweater and uh, I have to go to my restaurant because we have a lot of uh, reservations tonight and uh, wish me good luck I can handle that easily um, yeah that's it thanks for watching thanks for joining subscribe 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 and uh, stay sexy don't leave me see you soon again bye